Best defense in the league, they say. Really? What's poppin' y'all? It's your man, Clubboy Bass, and I'm here with another special edition of Wisco Sports! And just like that, Packers are on to the NFC Championship game. One more win away from a Super Bowl. It's exciting as it is, and I am pumped. I I believe it's gonna happen. This is the this is the year it will happen. We put up 32 points against what people claim is the best defense in the NFL. Yes, 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 yes. And yes, we do have to wait till tomorrow to determine who are we going to play. It will either be Tom, Tampa Brady or the Saints. So it's exciting. We still got a couple more games to play. Exciting matchups, uh, Titans and Ravens. And as well, we got the Chiefs and the Browns, as well as the Saints and the Tampa Bay. But you know what it is. We win. That's what matters. Um, and this was a game that... Like, every single third quarter, I get nervous. I don't know why this keeps happening, but we always come through in the first half, do some demolishing stuff, and then third quarter, we just fall asleep, and then the fourth quarter, we just pull away. And it seems to be that, you know, usually we run the ball, but we always keep passing and like to keep chewing clock. And this Packers team, I think, has really just proven themselves. Um, This is a team that... I think really can do it. Um, obviously, you saw my intro video. I'm really hyped on that new track by Lil Wayne. Um, you know, that that's that's what matters. So, final score, 32-18. Uh, I was kind of expecting this. Uh, I said this was going to be a six-score game, but a little couple more points than I thought were going to be put up. Um, but Packers really do did demolish some. Um, how um normal I normally I give the MVP to Rodgers or Aaron Jones or an offensive player but believe it or not my MVP of today's game is El Elton Jenkins. I never thought I'd have him as MVP but everybody was talking about how Aaron Donald and this defense is really going to get in Rodgers face. Everyone's talking about how Ramsey is going to go off on Devontae Adams and I'm just like, yeah, um it was interesting. Um, how about looking at the stats tonight? Uh, Rodgers, 23 out of 36, 296 yards and two touchdowns, 108 quarterback rating, no sacks allowed. So shout out to the offensive line. That's why I have to give it to Elgin Jacobs because he did a phenomenal job taking care of Aaron Donald. A lot of times he wasn't in the game due to some injuries, but it was all right. Aaron Jones... 14 carries, 99 yards, and a touchdown. 12 and for 65 for Jamal Williams and 6 for 27 for A.J. Dillon. Rodgers also had a rushing touchdown today. Uh, I mean, four carries for negative three yards, but of course he had to kneel to end the game, so that's why he's in negative yardage. Uh, on the receiving end, Alan Lazard, four catches, 98 yards, including the dagger, uh, which was that 58-yard uh, touchdown on... And then Adams had 9 for 66 in the touchdown. Robert Tony had 4 for 60. Um, um, Valdez Scantling, 4 for 33. St. Brown, 1 for 27. Um, and then how about Chris Barnes on the defensive end? 10 tackles total, 7 of them solo. Almost had an interception. Uh, no interceptions. A couple sacks. Uh, Rashawn Gary and Kenny Clark, both a sack and a half. And Zedaria Smith had the other one. Um... A couple tackles for a loss for both of those guys. Um, and then on the Rams side, um, Jared Goff, 21-27, a touchdown. Cam Akers, 18 carries for 90 yards and a touchdown. And then uh, Van Jefferson, 6 catches for 46 yards and a touchdown. Josh Reynolds, 3 for 65. And Robert Woods, 8 for 48. So, yeah. And then on their side, Reeder had 30 team tackles. Johnson had 9 yeah, um, everyone was talking about giving the hype to Jalen Ramsey and all that. And, okay, you got to give credit. Jari Alexander's better than what 
Everyone's talking this Jalen Ramsey this, Jalen Ramsey that, but no Jari Alexander. So you want to you want to keep talking about how overrated we are, ESPN? Please, please do. We we we're in the NFC Championship again. Lafleur has done it again. Uh, twenty eight and seven record in his first two seasons as a head coach. Please, please shut your mouth, ESPN. We're better than what you think. And it's very annoying that you keep bringing this up about us. We're very good. We're in this position, so I don't know what y'all are talking about. Just, just saying. Um, but great job for Elgin Jenkins, who's my MVP of the game. Who has, he was really doing a great job against Donald. I mean, obviously Rodgers three total touchdowns and Jones had a great game too. But you got to give credit. Um, and Chris Barnes, in my opinion, is just the emerging player undrafted and he comes in and he's really been the captain of this defense um after obviously replacing um who am <laughs> ah, Blake Martinez so that that's what really mattered um so I'm absolutely astounded and happy that we are moving on and I think you know this is the year we can get in um I think with the way the offense is playing we can do it I believe in, I believe in this team um, of course, as I said before, um, I'll be really looking forward to who we, we end up playing against. Um, if that ends up being uh, the Saints or Tampa Bay, I'm, of course, scared of Tampa Bay because that's the only game and we really struggled against. But the way this offense is playing, I just, I'm speechless. I'm happy. Um, and that's just a good way to be a Packer fan. That's just a great way. You know, you know, the month of January, nothing, nothing can stop Lambeau Field. Nobody can stop us. We're, we're impossible to stop. I mean, clearly, um, I think this team definitely has so much to look up to. And you know what? No Bakhtiari, and they didn't allow a sack on that incredible defense. That's just really has to do everything. That's why this offensive line is clearly one of the best in the league. Everybody knows it. Um, well, I think we do have the best offensive line in the league. Everyone gives credit to Rodgers. Everyone gets credit to Devontae Adams, Aaron Jones. Our offensive line is the reason why he's successful. Everybody knows that. And our coaching, you got to give credit to our coaching. That's what mattered. Um, being Aaron Rodgers, you got to be happy to be in this position. And he, he will probably have another chance to get another Super Bowl. One more win. One more win. Yeah, that's that. Got to keep being kings in the north. Got to keep being... Stop telling us what we're overrated. Rodgers is the MVP. That's that. There's nothing new. We just got to keep playing, poising, and doing what we do. It's exciting. It's very exciting. And, yeah, you know, I want to talk more, but... I mean, obviously, there's nothing else to talk about. So, obviously, I'll be making another video pretty soon after this one. Obviously, tomorrow I'll be wrapping up and doing my stuff. And then you'll see my prediction videos for the championship games next week. So, that's that. So, anyways, this is your man, Clockboy Bales. Be sure to subscribe below and comment with your thoughts. And, anyways, this is your man, Clockboy Bales. Again, be safe, stay smart, and as a... Well, Stay safe. Be smart. I'm sorry. I'm really happy right now. And as always, go pack go. We'll see you next time. It's like, yeah.